Nobody likes a stolen kid. Nothing makes a man more mad than the thought of an innocent in danger. Especially if that man is a cop. And if you come for a cop's kid, it's personal. Let's talk about Ridley Pearson's The Pied Piper. reviews books and I am Matt and I am the crossing guard for this here station channel whatever this is a book review channel dedicated mostly to older books like today uh, books that were at one time bestsellers but now are more likely to be found in a box in your garage or in a used bookstore Today, we're talking about The Pied Piper by Ridley Pearson. The Pied Piper is a loo- So, the, li the Pied Piper by Ridley Pearson is a uh, Lou Bolt novel. Lou Bolt, if you're not familiar with the Lou Bolt series, is a Seattle Police Department detective. Over the years, he has been promoted a couple of times in the course of the series. Uh, in the current book, in, in The Pied Piper, he is a lieutenant with Seattle Police Department's Intelligence Department. Their division. Intelligence Division. That's the word I'm looking for. And then uh, the Pied Piper hits. The Pied Piper is a serial kidnapper. By the time the Pied Piper hits Seattle, he or she or they have already hit like San Diego and Portland and Santa Cruz and... Uh, it's a West Coast thing. And that means that there is a FBI investigation ongoing as well. So the feds show up. And let me tell you something. Ridley Pearson really has never written a federal agent who's like a good guy. They always seem just a little shitty. And in fact, the relationship between the Seattle Police Department and Lou Bolt specifically, and the FBI, is much like uh, how in early hard-boiled hard -boiled detective novels, the private eye was, had a, their relationship was to the city police. It's hard-boiled. And Lou Bolt even wears a suit, right? He's a suit guy, likes to actually look pretty good. He's a, a tea-drinking, scone-eating, jazz-listening kind of guy and when the feds show up they're all hot to get the pied piper of course but as much as they are go get them type a personalities it does seem like the fbi is not really helping the seattle P police department do its job while the task force is trying to work with the feds and the feds aren't really seeming to work with the uh task force the police uh, I started getting a sense that there was an inside job, you know, like, first of all, I'm like, I've read this book before. I know what these beats, these beats just seem like I've, I've been here as it goes along. I'm like, I know, I think I know who it is. I think I know who the perpetrator is. Wrong. I had no idea who it was, really. I was actually surprised. I, I th I'm pretty sure. I'm like 98% sure I read the stupid book before, so I was 98% sure I knew who did it, which means when I was wrong, it was like, oh, that's a nice surprise. I got it wrong the entire time. You would say they do catch the bad guy. Before they do, though, before they do, the bad guy, the unknown subject, unsub, the perpetrator, uh, actually kidnaps Lou Bolt's daughter. Uh, so it makes it personal. And they put pressure on Lou to try and derail the investigation, you know, betray his oath to the police department and 
all that. And the fact that I was wrong, also, by the way, it's great. I liked being wrong. It was like reading it for the first time all over again. That was awesome. Just enjoyable. In the end, I liked this book. This was a good book. It had a swift read. It was suspenseful. That, that's the kind of thing you want in a mystery. And the kind of thing that you just throw in your purse or your backpack. Pick up the Pied Piper and bring it with you wherever you're going and read it on your lunch or something like that. That's the gist of what I was trying to get at here. And if you have read uh, this one, uh, what's your favorite mystery or your favorite detective novel? Hard boiled. I hope you liked this video. If you did, click or tap that like button. It's down below. It's the little thumbs up symbol. And if you really want to stick around because this is your cup of tea, hit subscribe. And then that notification bell so you can know when I upload. So far, so good. 2021. Knock on wood. And with that, see you next time.